Hey everyone, welcome back to another amazing video. Today we're going to check out the August update of Adobe XD which just came out. Now this is one of the most interesting updates of Adobe XD because I have never seen such features in any other design tool out there. So without further ado, let's just check out these features. Before we check out these features, make sure you are following me on Instagram because I do a lot of cool giveaways, a lot of cool challenges on my Instagram at Puneet Chavla official. Okay, to begin with, the first feature is called multiple flows. And multiple flows basically allows you to create different versions of the same design or the same application just like that. So it's simple. As you can see, I have created a prototype which goes from this screen to this screen to then this screen. Now, I'm not sure about the first screen. So what I'll do is I'll hold Option or Alt on the keyboard, drag this first artboard out just like this. First of all, as you can see, the, the prototype is still maintained. So nothing has changed. The flow will remain the same. Now comes the actual interesting part. If I click on this artboard per se, and I then click on this little tag on the left, I will get this new label on top, which says flow one. Now this is completely new. I can change this to anything else. I can change this to a uh, main flow or something like that. And with the second artboard, which is the second version, I can basically do the same thing. Click on this tag here and then change it to secondary or some anything like that you can basically give any name to this maybe let's try whether we can give an emoji to this okay we cannot give an emoji but it's cool so this way adobe allows you to now version all your designs not only that when you are sharing it it will share based on your different flows so for example i say flow one it will just share the flow one and if i click on flow two, which is the third one here, it will create a link or share just the third artboard. So whichever artboard you select, the flow will continue from there. The second feature is not anything physical, but it's some really cool new shortcuts. Now these keyboard shortcuts are both supported on Windows as well as Mac. If I go ahead and say command option one, it will shift to design. And if I say command option two, it will shift to prototype. If I say command option three, it will shift to share. Really, really simple uh, shortcuts, but they are really, really helpful and saves a lot of time. If we look at the change log, as you can see, there is one more thing which says main component. In Adobe XD, as well as Figma Sketch, you will see main component here rather than parent component or a default component. This is a standard which Adobe XD, Sketch and Figma got together and set for the design industry. If you want to read about the full update apart from just this video in detail, you can go ahead. I will give a link in the description. You can go and read their official blog right here. If you like that video, make sure to subscribe to the channel and also hit that like button. I would also like to know whether you like this Adobe XD update or not. I will see you every Monday and Thursday, same time. God bless.